Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's 10 box sweet spot baseball mixer. It's a random team break and we're giving away that 9510 Acuna. It's number to number to 50 as well. So you got a good number on here as well. Some pretty good stuff from update. And here are the boxes in the break. Also great stuff in this mixer as well. So good mixer, good boxes, a chance at a Ronald Acuna Jr. Um, thanks to Thanks to nobody. Nobody's on that list right now. Thanks to... Got too eager for this break. Thanks to those wonderful people right there. We appreciate you getting in. Some of you got spots straight up. I appreciate that. Someone got, in, got spots via the fillers. I appreciate that as well. Thank you. All baseball teams are in. No combos. There's the spreadsheet right there. Let's roll it. Let's randomize each list one and a five, six times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Sixth and final time. After six times, we got Ryan H. All the way down to Ryan C. One and a five, six times for the teams. One. Two, three, four, five, and good luck. Sixth and final time. After six, we got the Texas Rangers down to the Colorado Rockies. All right, so Ryan H. With the Rangers, Steve with the Cubs, Ryan C. with the Red Sox, Travis with the Rays, Ryan C. with the Angels, Matt with the Cardinals, Ryan with the Nats, Tony with the Pirates, Townsend, you got the Mets and the Tigers, Colin with the Phillies, Darren with the Royals, Jay with the Yankees, Townsend with the Braves, Raymond with the A's, Yancey with the Reds, Lonnie with the O's, Matt with the White Sox, Jay with the Astros, Ben with the Padres, Ryan C. Last Spot Mojo Star, next to your name, Marlins. Matt Medlin with the Diamondbacks, Oliver Smith with the Giants, Townsend, Jack, you have the Blue Jays and the Twins, Matt L with the Brew Crew, Matt, uh, Ryan C with the Mariners, Matt, you have the Indians, Ryan C, you have my Dodgers and the Colorado Rockies. So let's get all this on one screen and alphabetize by column B right here. And I'm going to pause the video when we come back. I'm going to have the boxes all set up here. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. And then we'll have the break. Stick around. I'll be right back. All right. Welcome back, folks. We did have a trade. A's Rangers are trade. So Ryan H. out of the Rangers spot and into the A's spot. And Raymond out of the A's spot and into the Rangers spot right here. So we'll put T next to there to see who draws first blood in that trade. So let's print. Let's press the print button. There we go. And rip. Good luck. That's the giveaway. So if you're having a pretty terrible break, or if you got randomized a team you don't like, just keep keep this in mind. We're giving this away at the end. I don't think I could get this hair Fabio length. That, 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 that would be way too much. I couldn't do that. This is a 10 box break. Come on, man. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's what it says on the on, on Jaspie's 10 box sweet spot baseball mixer. Cut my hair with a box cutter? Of course I could do that. There, done. <laughs> my power diminishing with each slice. Right, here are the exclusives right here. I, I don't know if I'd want to sell my locks of hair though, Mac and, and Mike. Because uh, 
because I mean, what what if what if someone creates an unauthorized clone of me? That's what I'd be worried about. Or they could plant my hair at a murder scene. No thanks. No thanks. Don't want to be framed for for murders most foul. Is that how they start Sky High? How does Sky High know? Concerns me. Travis, yes, Brendan McKay is a big name to chase for the Rays. One of the could be one of the top prospects. One of the top top prospects for the Rays, definitely. Could be a big rookie this year. But clones would be awesome, Mac. That'd be awesome. We could always break. Then 24-hour breaks with Joe and his clones. I don't know. I feel like one Joe's already a handful. I think I think I think each Joe's would 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 probably argue with each other. What's up, Joe P? Yeah, no hat today. I brought a hat in case this bothers me, but I'm trying it out. I can't wear a hat every day. It's just too much. Been doing that for too long. Also, I'm trying out for uh, I'm trying out for BTS after work. So, all right, here's uh, some series one. Let's just fly through this. I think actually for the Rays, there may be some Arizarenas hiding in here somewhere, right? It's another solid player. Thanks, Joe P. I, 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 I just need barber shops to open up again soon. We need the, we need people to follow directions. We need to flatten this curve, get the vaccines rolled out. Let's o let's open up some uh, let's open up some barber shops. You know, so I can support my local barber shop. I don't know if people with long hair do it. It's a. Uh, it's much warmer on top of my head too, like temperature wise. <laughs> Gotta deal with that. There you go, there's Brendan McKay. For both, with, with both. Where, what happened to the barbershop quartet? I wanna open up a barbershop where it actually has a barbershop quartet. There's uh, some 70s Dodgers here, and it's numbered as well. It's a 299, 005 out of 299. I think, would, would, would old Don Sutton be part of these old 60s, 70s Dodgers? I think so. RIP Don Sutton. There's, this is for my Dodgers, Ryan Carlson. Yeah, RIP Tommy as well. There's Tommy the Sordis picture on there too. There's the uh, AL Rookie of the Year. That goes to Ryan Carlson and the M's. What boxes would I recommend you buying for 100 bucks or less? I'm not sure. That's a good question. That's a decent budget, though. Um, whatever it is, it would have to be anything on jaspies.com where you can get personal boxes. We can send them to you sealed, or we can open them up uh, for you on Instagram Live. I think Jason just got here, and he's he's setting setting up for the day, so they'll be on soon. There's a nice Mike Trout there. A little foil. Now remember, it's it's vet commons don't ship, but every rookie card you see will ship. Inserts will ship, obviously. And this Mike Trout would ship anyway. But different parallel, I think. A little different boost in value. Anything with Trout on it's pretty good.
There's a relic here. That's Steven Strasburg. All-star relic. For some Randy Arozarenas, there's Ray's Uni here. Another relic, Alex Bregman. For the Strohs, that'll be for Jay Goins. Get get my hair trending on Twitter. Maybe I'll have to pull like a monster one of one out of this mixer. Brian Johnson for the Red Sox. That'll be Ryan Carlson. Ryan with Brian. That is 491 out of 2020. There's Mike Trout again. I feel like we don't see a lot of these foil Mike Trouts. It's another one for the Angel. That's Ryan Carlson. Piece of uh, Nolan Arenado's lumber right there for the Rocks. Ryan Carlson with that as well. Encarnacion. I know this is a baseball break, folks, but Philip Rivers announcing, officially announcing his retirement. Is that uh, Philip Rivers a Hall of Famer? I think so. I don't know if he's a first ballot Hall of Famer, but he's got to be a Hall of Famer at some point, eventually. I think uh, maybe, maybe not for anything, you know, individually exceptional, but I think there is something to be said about if you can survive in the National Football League for as long as he did and play at the level that he has played at, I mean, he's one of those volume guys, you know, that are that are gonna be. You're gonna look at his numbers and be like, "Yeah, dang," <laughs> you know that those are HOF numbers. It's just a shame. There's nine out of twenty-five. It's Max Scherzer, Nationals. So a couple Nationals relics for Ryan Carlson. Just a shame that he hasn't really. You know, you would have liked to see him seen him in uh, see him win a Super Bowl. I, I realized also, he, I don't know if you guys overheard this in the background on SportsCenter, um, Philip Rivers was part of a draft class that included like Eli Manning and Ben Roethlisberger, right? Maybe a couple other QBs? Yeah, Eli did cry when he got drafted by Sandy. <laughs> but that, actually, that turned out to be a pretty solid quarterback class if you think about it. It was Devin Williams. Devin Williams for the Brew Crew, Matt Lieber. Exactly, yeah, Pat. I agree. I, th I think the I think the volume argument does 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 make sense. Because not only yeah, I mean to put up to put up those quality numbers, he had a pretty decent season last year too. I think he could have probably played another year or two before there was like serious noodle arm decline. We got Ichiro. 
Mariners edition going to Ryan Carlson in Seattle. All right, there you go. Oh, and we got these exclusives right here too. So there's the these patches are pretty great. Here are the exclusive cards. I right, got a nice green Bo Bichette right here too. 66 out of 99 for Seattle. Seattle for Toronto. That's going to be for Townsend. Blue Jays adding uh, George Springer to that team, right? And I love these. They're, this one, this one's Buster Posey. It's a patch. Get get a get a get a nice denim jacket. If you're a Giants fan, get a denim jacket. You pop that Buster Posey on there, you'll be the coolest kid on your block. I assure you that. I guarantee you that. Nice Levi's denim jacket. And then people go, hey, is that, is that a Buster Posey patch on your sweet denim jacket? And be like, yeah, you're the coolest kid on the block. That goes to Oliver Smith and the Giants. Yeah, I saw that. That yeah, looks like someone jumped the gun on the Brant Michael Brantley news. Michael Brantley was, I saw that too. Was said to have gone to blue to Toronto as well, but but no, he's officially back with the with the Astros. Yeah, I think I agree with Sean Jaspi. L LT is definitely when I think Chargers, I definitely think LT, then Gates, then Rivers. I wonder what happened. There must have been at least, or everyone was was relying on one source that was that was just leading people astray. What's up, Jason? Hold on. It's one thing if just one person jumps the gun, but if a lot of people jump the gun, then. And there must I feel like there's another little layer to that story. Okie doke. So what what year is this? this is twenty fifteen? Panini Elite Baseball. So do I flip these this way, maybe? Yeah. All right, again, all these RCs will ship. Four autos or memorabilia cards per box on average. Oh, and there's a one on one Madison Bumgarner. All-star salutes for San Francisco. It's not bad. I wouldn't expect this one of one popping out of here. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. For my rivals, the Giants. That's for Oliver Smith. Remember how good Tim Lincecum was? Oh, nope. It's Christian Walker, not someone else. Brandon Finnegan. Oh, no, Yelich, I think we'd find in 2013. Brandon Finnegan for Kansas City going to Darren. Members only. Alexi Ramirez for the, this looks like White Sox. Alexi Ramirez, it, yes, a White Sox.
So this relic will go to Matt Lieber. Baez rookie card for the Cubs. That'll be for Steve Birch. We've got career best materials. Prince Fielder, 31 out of 299, piece of his lumber. Brew crew, Matt Lieber with the Brewers. We've got a Pablo Sandoval, Red Sox edition, 37 out of 48. Die cut for Ryan Carlson and the Red Sox. And there's our autograph out of here, the Danny Santana, 21st century auto for the Twins, Townsend with Minnesota. Go to 2013 select baseball. There's some, some nice stuff in here. I think Arenado is a rookie here. I think Yelich is a rookie in here. Is Garrett Cole maybe a rookie in here? Good luck. Good luck. So we're going to work through the rest of these base heavy boxes right here, and then we'll flip around to maybe some Bowman's best, some Bowman back there. Maybe we'll close out with that that leaf. Do some nice stuff, some nice stuff in there, and then we'll give away that Acuna Junior, which would be really nice. Looking forward to that. What else has been going on in baseball? Oh, Angels signed Jose Quintana, so add into that rotation. Blue Jays and Kirby Yates agreed to a deal. The old Padres closer. White Sox got Liam Hendricks. I think we saw that. Oh yeah, Padres got Joe Musgrove. I thought that was a, that was a good move too. Twins to sign J Hap. I think that's the that's the latest. Unless there's anything else in the pipelines, we should know about this. Lurie Garcia. I say Kettle Marte. There's for Seattle, there's uh, Bobby Lefrombois. We're boys. 204 out of 750. Mariners, Ryan Carlson. No, yeah, that Cole, Cole definitely, definitely worth, definitely worth that. Padre's kind of a scary good, uh, Rotation now. There's Matt Adams. I'm not sure what the what the Dodgers are gonna do in response, or if they even have to do anything. They got a lot of depth in their organization. Yeah, that's a bit of an issue, right? That Angels clubhouse guy trying to blow the whistle on all pitchers. Here's the thing, though. I think that the dirty secret is that is that uh, every pitcher. Does something to the ball. <laughs> I mean, that's not a that's not a secret, right? Like everyone does something with the ball. Every single pitcher. In fact, hitters want them to 
to muck up the ball a little bit so it doesn't slip out of their hands and hit them in the head. So that's why it's very few times where managers call out pitchers for like illegal substances. This is Chris Rusin, Chicago White Sox man. Cubs. But like all the all the pitchers have like little little ro extra rosin in the the heel of their glove. Right? You see how dirty Clayton Kershaw's hats are? <laughs> Everyone does it. And there's Casey Kelly for San Diego. Another Padre for uh, Ben Ramirez. All right, now let's get into some Stadium Club. 2020 Stadium Club. Yeah, Danny. Sean was in the chat a little bit earlier. He said yes. He's a Chargers fan. He, of course, he's going to say yes. But I think so too. I think I think Philip Rivers will eventually be a Hall of Famer. Maybe I don't, I don't know if he's going to be a first ballot Hall of Famer. It depends on I guess who else is 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 up for that. But but yeah, he, I mean he should be he should be eventually. Yeah, he he's amassed enough stats where where statistically he's just, he just has to get in. You know, maybe there might be some vote. I, I actually, who votes for this? Is this like a Baseball Writers of America sort of organization? Is Hall of Fame? Is there a committee that votes on? We don't know how that works for football. All right, there's Barry Zito, some sort of variation. No, maybe not. He's just flipped around. Oh, there's a Pro Football Writers Association, Pat is saying. And they're the ones voting on it. All right, there you go. So, yeah, I think he's well-liked among writers, right? Emperors of the Zone. I don't think I've ever seen that insert out of Stadium Club. Basically, you're looking for the different foil right here at the bottom. Yeah, Rivers' throwing motion was a little weird. A member of the media that covered them in their city would present them to the Hall of Fame committee. So it would be like these writers San Diego for interesting. I actually did not didn't know how that worked. I don't know why 
these cards are flipped right side up and upside down. These are jamming me up here. Classic. Power zone, Fernando Tatis Jr. Oh, and there's an autograph right there, and it's going to be... It's going to be Justin Dunn, rookie auto for the M's. That'll be for Ryan Carlson, won that spot in the absolute filler. There's Gavin Lux right there as well. All right, next box. Looks like uh, Alan Ginter Chrome Edition. Yeah, I, I guess I just didn't do, do enough stadium club. The cars flip right side up and upside down. Uh, today's not a, a Raiders hat day. So no, I'm trying, trying a no hat day, but I think I'm gonna have to pop a hat on because his hair is just all over the place. My picks for the weekend, I'm on Green Bay, minus three, and, uh, and Buffalo, plus three. Well, I don't know. Is Mah I, I don't know if Mahomes is going to play. I think that I think that I think that's the issue. That's why I took. That's why I took Buffalo. Because he's just barely going to be out of concussion protocol. I think he still has a has a foot issue or toe issue or something like that. And at worst or at best, he has a, like a pinched nerve in his neck or something. He's not going to be as mobile as you want Mahomes to be. He can still sling it, no doubt. But but I don't know. Like. You know, one one weird hit, you know, and they're gonna they're gonna be like, yeah, you're out. You got a concussion last week. Even if it's mild, I think they, even if the the doctors upstairs, the third parties, even if they think it's close, I think they'll they'll be extra careful watching that player, especially if he's cleared. There's a booming city, Dubai. We'll randomize that to. Uh, I guess when we do the the Acuna randomizer, this group of non-sports will randomize to the second name down. Like these bug cards. And we've got a green Paul Molitor, 12 out of 99. This is Blue Jays edition going to Jack Townsend. Yeah, Travis thinks Mahomes isn't going to play. That's a big factor. Pat saying that, yeah, Josh Allen will have to play better. I, I, think, I think he will. There's Ryan Nyquist, 67 out of 99 for Houston. Or no, I'm sorry, For he's a BMX legend. <laughs> Not for Houston, I was just looking at the star on the hat. Like that star. 
think both games are on Sunday. There's Orlando Arcia to two, uh, to fifty for the Brew Crew. all these these little mini cards there's a there's a giraffe oh this is terrifying no thanks to the peacock spider Oof. no thanks their bright psychedelic color schemes and outrageous courtship dances make the peacock spider a fascination to arachnophiles I don't want to know an arachnophile, but not to, uh, but not to uh, squeamish arachnophobes. Seven new species of this tiny harmless spider identified in early 2000. Harmless, sure. That's what they say. That, that's what Big Spider wants you to believe, that they're harmless. What about the Hercules beetle? Okay, these guys are kind of cool. These guys are all right. There's the Atlas moth. Atlas moth, that moth, I guess. I'm neutral about moths. All right, I like this guy, the gray crowned crane. I like cranes, cranes, egrets. These guys are pretty cool. I don't know who this, who is this guy? I don't know who this person is. There's Istanbul, or for you old school guys out there, Constantinople. which will show you your age, probably a couple hundred years old. There's a dragonfly. I don't mind the dragonfly, they're okay too. They're all right, okay, it was just that spider that I disliked there. All right, let's move on to archives. This is regular archives. We've got signature series in the site that we're gonna do a couple breaks of tonight. Schedules in the chat. I don't know why they even put these in here. They're gonna mess up the corners like this, but That'll go to the Yankees. It's a cool looking uh, little mini poster there. All right, so let's get all this. Yeah, so far that A's Rangers trade is is pretty is pretty even. I mean, maybe there are some random rookie cards in there somewhere. I don't know. We'll see. We got one, two, three, four boxes to go. Dirty water's in a separate tank. The Bissell Crosswave and self-cleaning. I need me. I need a vacuum upgrade. Brantley, two years, 32 million. That's not bad. He can stay healthy. Remember that one year with the Indians? He was like on, he was, there was like a little bit of MVP talk, maybe three fourths of the way through the season, but it's like injuries. The old injury bug got to Michael Brantley, which has been his, which, which has been his problem.
All right. Nice Aros Arania. These are all facsimile autographs, by the way, in case you're like, wait, are these are these like five million autographs in here? No, they're not. Rivers, that river's throwing motion is wild, but you know what? You know what they say. If you're comfortable with it and it's effective, no need to change it. There's Blue Moon Odom for the A's. That goes to Ryan Harold. He draws first blood in that Rangers A's trade. Blue Moon. Saw me standing alone. There's Jose Abreu. We've got a Brad Keller. Light blue, that's the 25 down there, bottom right hand corner. And we got another autograph, that's Dave Martinez. Ryan Carlson with the Nationals. And the Brad Keller will go to Darren and KC. All right, let's get into some contenders draft picks from 2019. Rivers plants Philip Rivers plants coach high school football. Hired at St. Michael Catholic High School in Alabama prior to the season, apparently. I guess, I guess his kids are gonna go there. Coach his kids. That'll be pretty cool. What do you think Rivers does after? After coaching? Broadcast booth maybe? Coaching? Does he does he go into college coaching? Good luck, everybody. We might need a little help here. We got a, we got a Matt Walner, a Golden Eagle, cracked ice to twenty three. I say he's he sounds like a White Sox to me. Matt Walner is a twin. That'll be for Townsend in Minnesota. We got Logan Davidson, that's a White Sox. Right, to 15. Ah, an A, an Oakland A, damn it. That's gonna go to Ryan Harrell, that's a low number there. 
We've got 76 out of 99, Seth Johnson. Seth Johnson sounds like... I don't know, nothing, nothing in my head for Seth Johnson. Seth Johnson is a Tampa Bay Ray. So that'll go to Travis in Tampa Bay. You're now a Seth Johnson fan. different for a second right now. Just, just one of the season tickets. We got Corey Lee. 10 out of 99. I say Corey Lee sounds like a tiger. Corey Lee, show me tigers. No, different orange team, Astros. You got the color right. Houston, that'll go to Jay Goins. Here is Zach Thompson. Zach Thompson. It's a nice autograph. College ticket, chrome format, chrome design here. Six out of 20. I'm, I'm seeing blue team in my head. Wrong. Red team, he's a cardinal. That'll be for Matt Lieber and St. Louis. I know where he goes. That Nico Horner, season ticket cracked ice, is a Cub. That's the 23. That'll be for Steve Birch. And at TJ Sikama, is he a Blue Jay maybe? Or is that, I'm, maybe I'm thinking of TJ Zook. TJ Sikama Tiger maybe? No, he's a, he's a Yankee. He was a Tiger, turned into a Yankee. Jay Goins with the Bronx Bombers. Terrible at this. Terrible at these 2019 prospects here. All right, how about this guy? Orelvis Martinez, oh, it already says Toronto. 73 out of 99 for the Blue Jays. That's gonna be for Jack Townsend. There you go, and I think that's that. All right, so no, no Adley Rushman or anything. All right. Almost there, folks. Almost there. Let's get, uh, let's do this right here. What's this? 2012. Home, Bowman, home of the rookie card. Bryce Harper, Garrett Cole. But it's in this class too, says Ryan Harold. So let's see what we got. Good luck. There's Matt Latos. I guess any Mike Trout is nice, right?
Nothing crazy in that stack. James Loney. When the Dodgers had a lot of high hopes for old James Loney. Jose Osuna, Delmonico. Jorge Posada doubled, Bernie Williams scored, hit that game at two, he scored. There's, there's the Cespedes rookie card. That'll be for Ryan Harold and the A's. Oscar Tavares. So we're not seeing the guys on the box, but it's all right. Nothing ventured, nothing gained. All right, Bowman's best, and then we'll close out with that leaf. This is current Bowman's best, 2020 edition. I think we're still on the lookout uh, for still on the lookout for more cases of this. Keep an eye on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Good luck, we're almost there, and then Acuna time. Everyone get their uh, Mega Millions Powerball tickets today? I think tonight is Mega Millions, right? Powerball on Friday, something like that? Either way, I got both. I think I'd build a build a house with a lazy river. How about that? I would love a lazy river. All right, right off the top is Spencer Torkelson. Big prospect for the Tigers. That'll be for Jack Townsend. Yeah, John, I'm, I'm, I think I'm going to have to pop a, a hat back on, though. I don't know how people with long, longer hair do this. What am I, a, a pop star? 129 to 150, Tim Anderson, White Sox. I need I need barber shops to open back up so I can can't wear a hat every day. <laughs> what am I? Nine? Nine years old? That's for the Orioles. It's really the only reason why I've been wearing so many hats lately. We got Casey Schmidt. On card autograph with the Giants, Oliver Smith with the Schmidt. Yeah, I was hanging out with Bieber. Bieber stylist. Nice Jason Dominguez die cut there. Zach Veen for the Rocks, Ryan Carlson. There he is. There's another Zach Veen. And Max Muncy. That's my guy right there. 26 out of 50. Max Muncy, Dodgers, Ryan Carlson. You know what? I, Dodgers really haven't made a lot of moves this offseason. They've got some pending free agents I feel like they need to resign. What are they going to do with Kike Hernandez, Jock Peterson, Justin Turner? 
some question marks out there. And another giant, Jalen Davis. So aside from the first auto, this is all, all NL West. Two giants for Oliver Smith. All right, now let's see what we got in this final box. going to show you the inside of this box, but it's a clear box. Force of habit. We're going to lead off with 17 out of 50, Ultimate Destinations, Detroit, Dylan Dingler. There you go, 75 point top loader here. Nice, that's for the Tigers, Jack Townsend. We've got 2020 Ultimate Draft Future Stars, Ivan Herrera. All right, I have no idea where he goes. Ryan Harold saying Cardinals. Let's check. Ivan Herrera is a is a St. Louis Cardinal. And that'll be for Matt Lever. What about what about Yiddy Cap? He sounds like I have no idea. Another Cardinal? Yiddy Cap is, we got Ryan and Lion saying Marlins. Yeah, he's, he is confirmed, a Marlin. I think he has, he has my birth date too. What about Sammy Infante? He sounds like a tiger. Or maybe I'm thinking of Omar Infante. This is a national. That'll be for Ryan Carlson. What about AJ Vuk Vukovic? AJ Vukovic sounds like a royal. He is a diamondback. Yeah, D back says Ryan Harold and Travis. I know where this guy goes. There's Asa Lacey for Darren and the Royals. Nice. So nice, that's a nice finish. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. Nice break. So we're going to give away the Acuna Jr. And then we'll do a quick recap. Good luck. So let's go back to some fresh dice. There we go. We've got a fresh list next to it. Yes. 
Let's get, grab everybody's names from Matt and the Diamondbacks all the way down to Ryan and the Nationals and everybody in between. Good luck. This is the 9510 Acuna Jr. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. One and a five, six times. Name on top gets the Acuna Jr. Second name down will get all those non-sports cards uh, out of um, Allen Ginter Chrome. So six. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. After six, thanks everyone for giving this a shot. Appreciate you trying. Consolation prize for Jay Goins. You'll get all those non-sports cards out of Ginter Chrome. And congrats to Ryan Carlson with a spot that he bought straight up. You're going to be getting the 9510 Ronald Acuna Jr. Pretty nice stuff. Gold refractor parallel. Centering edges are a 10. Corners are 9.5. Surface a 9. Auto is a 10. 32 out of 50 on that. And there you go. Congrats. So here on the 20th to... To Ryan Carlson from the baseball mixer. Congrats. There you have it. I'm Joe for JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye bye.